In the 1930s and 40s, America's national pastime, baseball, ruled the professional sports landscape. It was popular, but it lacked one thing, any players that weren't white. In 1946, the general manager of the Brooklyn Dodgers, Branch Rickey, began the task of righting this wrong. Rickey knew the magnitude of what he was about to do, and he knew the first Major League Baseball player to break the color barrier had to be a home run pick. Rickey chose Jackie Robinson to bake the bold move. Jackie Robinson was one of the most talented base runners in the Negro Leagues, but he wasn't considered their best player. Many of the people who followed the Negro Leagues thought Kansas City Monarchs pitcher Satchel Paige, a player many consider the best to ever set foot on a pitcher's mound, or Homestead Grays catcher Josh Gibson, who slugged almost 800 home runs in his professional career, to be the best players to play in the Negro Leagues. But Branch Rickey wasn't looking for the best player. He was looking for the player most capable of paving the way to additional African-American players to make their way to Major League Baseball. And in his mind, there was no better choice than Jackie Robinson. When discussing with Robinson what life would be like for the first African-American baseball player, Rickey is said to have told Jackie Robinson that Rickey chose him not because he needed someone with the strength to fight back the racial slurs and remarks that would be hurled his way, but he needed a player who had the courage not to. In the movie 42, a biopic about the life of Jackie Robinson, this scene shows how Ranch Rickey told Robinson what it would take for Robinson to help make the transition of black baseball players to the major league of success. People aren't going to like this. They're going to do anything to get you to react. Echo a curse with a curse and they'll, they'll hear only yours. Follow a blow with a blow and they'll say the Negro lost his temper. Your enemy will be out in force and you cannot meet him on his own low ground. We win with hitting, running, fielding, only that. We win if the world is convinced of two things, that you are a fine gentleman and a great baseball player. Everything that Brand Turkey had seen in Jackie Robinson came true. Robinson would make his debut for the Brooklyn Dodgers on April 15, 1947. Robinson batted 297 with 12 home runs and was named the first rookie of the year, an award which is now named after Jackie Robinson. Robinson had a magnificent career for the Brooklyn Dodgers before he retired after the 1956 season. He was named the league MVP in 1949 and he helped the Dodgers win the World Series in 1955. Robinson passed away in 1972 due to heart problems and complications from diabetes. Jackie Robinson would be inducted into the Baseball Hall of Fame in 1962. And in an unprecedented move on April 15, 1997, the 50th anniversary of the historic day Jackie Robinson broke the color barrier in baseball, Major League Baseball announced that the number 42 would be retired across the entire sport. Only those players who were wearing 42 at the time in honor of Robinson would be allowed to continue to wear 42. The Yankees closer Mariano Rivera was the last to wear the number in Major League Baseball. Jackie Robinson faced many trials as he broke the color barrier in baseball. But because of his courage and perseverance, many black athletes were able to follow in his footsteps across the sports landscape. This has been your Black History Sp Month Spotlight on the life and career of Jackie Robinson.